Hey guys, I'm going to work out outside again today and I'm going to do an arm workout for you guys. All you need for this workout are dumbbells and resistance bands, so let's have a great workout. I'm working outside again today, so uh, it is hot. It's only about 5 degrees cooler than what it was yesterday, and I didn't like that I didn't uh, get a super long workout. Um, I, it's not the fact that I didn't like it. Um, I just like to spend a little bit more time, but uh, I still felt good. And my chest is sore. Uh, my abs are a little bit sore. Um, but uh, I'm going to spend more time, take more breaks. Uh, the, where I showed you guys yesterday where the fishing equipment and my drinks and stuff are, that is shaded, so it keeps my drinks cooler. And since it's shaded, uh, when I'm resting, I'm not going to take my like one minute rests there, but if I feel like I'm getting a little hot I might take a three four five minute break to get out of the Sun um, and just go over there or I might go inside to cool off and come back inside you guys don't want to overheat when you're working out outside so just be cautious of that um, you push yourself but listen to your body at the same time okay so uh, I'm gonna log it I hope you guys enjoyed the workout yesterday follow me on Instagram the Wolverine fitness guy and uh, let's get to it My video didn't. My video didn't get uh, demonetized. I didn't get a strike or anything on the YouTube channel for the music. So maybe it was because I said I don't own the rights to this music. Maybe someone that's watching this could tell me uh, if I have to say that or not. If you hear the music or not, because I want to work out with music so I can hear it. Um, but uh, if you guys hear it, if YouTube hears it, I don't own the rights to this music. All right. But let's get this workout started. All right, my idea on the arms, um, I like to superset my arms a lot. I like to do biceps and triceps a lot uh, when I'm working arms together. Um, and if I'm using the same weight on my biceps and triceps, I try to get more on my triceps. Most of you guys probably can get more reps on your triceps too. Um, triceps are bigger muscle. There's more muscles in your back of your arm than there is right here in your bicep. Um, so your tricep makes up two thirds of your arm. So maybe do two thirds more reps. So do 66% more reps. Just an idea, that's my thought process. Um, but you guys just working out, you're gonna lose weight and you're gonna get stronger. So uh, unless you're taking, um, I don't know what that, 
injection steroid is where you inject it into your muscles and they get super big and like rocky and uh, uh, they look all blocky and stuff um, but if you're working out uh, naturally that stuff's never going to happen so even if it, you do 50 50 percent or you know 75 25 you're going to look uh, decent all right so just keep that in mind and girls um, and my muscles aren't super super huge or anything so don't be thinking that lifting weights is going to get you manly because it's only going to get you in shape and make you look fit so remember that So there's 25 hammer curls and 40 tricep extensions, two sets each. I'm going to keep doing those. I feel good. I'm going to keep doing them, but I'm logging it. All right, so we got 50 reps in on our biceps and 80 reps in on our triceps. Let's keep going. Uh, starting to get tired on the triceps but now we got 75 reps in on our biceps and 120 in on our triceps keep hydrated guys keep water in you make sure you guys if you're trying to build mass make sure you carb up before your workouts make sure you carb up after your workouts it's real important trying to lose weight maybe do this kind of workout in the morning before you eat so it's a fasted workout so your body's going through it's called a fasted workout because your body just slept so it didn't get any nutrients for you know five eight nine hours however long you slept so your body was fasting it doesn't have food on its stomach so when you work out doing that your body still has to utilize energy to work out so the energy it's going to use is the fat cells, all right? 
because that's all fat cells are. It's stored energy. It's not pretty to look at all the time, <coughs> but that's what it is. All right, let's get one more set of these in. The 30 on that one. Log it down, guys. Good job. Keep it up. You guys need to take breaks, pause it, drink water, take the rest. Push yourself, but take it if you need it. Good job, guys. <coughs> All right. I like to use my line as a measurement and then my foot as a measurement. So I know how far away I am when I'm doing my workout so I can measure the uh, resistance. We're going to do one arm resistance curls, super center with tricep push downs. Choco Mastas. Alright, so I did 25, I did 15, 15, 10, and 10, and then 50 straight.
15, 15, 10, 10, and then 50 again. Again, um, I'll take a picture of the log of my workout and put it on my Instagram, which is the Wolverine Fitness Guy, so you guys can see how it's logged. So you see that the supersets on my biceps, you'll see how I log that. take a water break all right guys I took a break for about five minutes um, I drank some water and I went inside cooled off a little bit used the restroom and came back outside you're outside you're sweating a lot so uh, um, if you do use the restroom you're probably only going to use it once because you're going to be sweating out all the other liquids so uh, Let's get back to it. Um, uh, two sets in uh, of the resistance curls and the tricep pushdowns, uh, the resistance tricep pushdowns. So uh, let's get back to go doing those. All right. Here's an important lesson too. Uh, so I just took a break for about five minutes and I went inside. Um, well, I went and got a drink of water and then I went inside to cool off and use the restroom while I was inside. And I came back out here and I literally didn't get to my first set before I had a phone call I had to take. And that phone call lasted about seven minutes. So I had about a 12 minute break and I feel like I have to restart my entire workout and get my pump back and everything. I was having a good start and everything. And a lot of times uh, when those important things in life happen and you still wanna work out because you wanna feel healthy and you wanna be healthy and that's important too, you have to force yourself to get back in that mindset, force yourself to work out again, force yourself to get uh, that pump back and push yourself uh, to be healthy and, and not quit, not give up, and not say, man, I just lost my pump, I lost my motivation because I, I, I took a 12-minute break when I wanted to take a 3-minute or a 4-minute or, you know, whatever it was. You, you can do it, you can get back into it, yeah, it'll take some time. You may not have as great of a workout, but um, something's better than nothing, doing more is better than less. So, uh, let's get back to the pump and... Uh, that uh, that's just a lesson you guys have to learn because sometimes that does happen in life so I hope you guys can take that and learn from it and uh, I'm gonna push myself through it because it'd be really easy for me to quit right now because uh, I, I, I feel lazy and relaxed now so let's get back into it
Yeah. Started singing in my head, so I hope I got the 50 on that one. I'm still trying to get back in the mindset too. This one, the last one.
superset biceps and triceps again. We're going to do a static alternating dumbbell curl and a static alternating tricep dumbbell extension. Now you don't need a bench for this. Because you can stand, you can lay on your back if you're at home and you have a mat and you're using the carpet, you can lay completely on your back and just do your tricep extensions like that, kind of like skull crushers. But we're going to start with the biceps first. And we're going to stand up and do these. So, how about I just go ahead and lay this down. As if I were laying flat on the ground. <coughs> so you guys can see me where I have enough room doing the curls and the extensions doing the superset. All right, like I said, static, alternating. Static means hold. So hold one. And there it is. That's all you do. You'll do the same thing right here. You'll hold one at 90 degrees and you'll rep out one arm while the other arm is in a static position, like so. Good doing those.
All right, cool. Let's do it, guys. That's hard. All right, we did it kind of heavier. Let's drop the weight. Now, I'm gonna do these ones, hammer curl, because if I do them regular, uh, these things come loose. So, uh, not all the time, but with as many reps as we're gonna be doing, they'll come loose and I don't wanna to have to keep adjusting them. They'll come loose doing hammer curls too, but it takes more time. And I'm not gonna, um, what I'm not going to do is I'm not going to uh, log that it's a hammer curl with the 10 pounds on my log because this is my equipment. I already know if it's 10 pounds, it's going to be a hammer curl because I'm just accustomed to doing it that way using uh, these adjustables. So I'll just keep logging it like normal where it's uh, 25 pounds for eight reps. It'll be 10 pounds for however many reps. If you see, I'm not using my gloves today because uh, I'm not doing a lot of stuff on the ground or on the stairs. Um, so just using your normal hands for grabbing the bands, grabbing the dumbbells, that's all you need. Uh, this is so you don't tear your hands up on the ground, all right? And if you want to, if, if you guys are just beginning to work out, and your hands haven't built up that uh, strength yet in the skin to handle the weight, use gloves. Don't let people at the gym call you a pussy or whatever for using gloves. Do whatever you need to do to get in shape. Do what you need to do to progress and don't worry about what other people think. Never worry about what other people think. If you know what you're doing is right, follow that path, all right? Let's get to it, enough talking. Ooh. Ah, 
hands. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Ah. Ah. I got the little neighbor boy watching me. feel it from holding it so long especially if you hold it in the middle of the dumbbell and don't let the plate rest you're going to use more of your grip strength instead of just letting it rest on your hand using your bicep if you hold it in the middle you got to actually hold it so if you notice in some of these exercises I've held it in the middle some I've let the plate rest just depending on how my forearms feel but I'm constantly consistently trying to push myself again.
Close to our chest. Just like this. feels good. feels like an isolation curl. I'm really squeezing up at the top. A lot of times I'll just do it with the uh, 25s and I'll just hold them both really close and tight but I'm just trying to show you guys different exercises because I've been holding a lot of alternating stuff. So I'm trying to do a single, uh, single dumbbell exercise for you guys to see also. I hope you guys are having a great workout also. I hope you guys are enjoying this. If you have any questions, if you guys want to see me do a certain kind of workout or you want to know how to work out certain body parts, if you have questions about nutrition, questions about supplementation, hit it in the comment section below. I'll answer your questions. All right, follow me on Instagram, the Wolverine Fitness Guy. All right, so uh, I hope you enjoyed this workout. I'm gonna finish up, I'm almost done. Got a nice little pump going on. Guys wanna, if you guys want to see uh, videos of me working out at the gym, let me know also. Um, I can uh, get someone to record me, record some videos or something for me while I'm working out at the gym. So uh, just let me know if that's something you guys might be interested in because uh, I can show you a lot more stuff at the gym. Um, and uh, I, I just want to help you guys. So any questions you have, let me know. I'm here to help. Um, I can't be with every single one of you guys personal training. I can't work out with you guys um, personally one-on-one -on -one because there's too many people in the world. So 
hopefully these videos will help you guys, motivate you, teach you something, give you a workout to follow. Remember, I log all the workouts. I'm putting them on my Instagram, the Wolverine Fitness Guy, um, so you guys can actually see the workout and you can log it, um, or at least write down the exercises and then follow it yourself. So, hope you like it. Ah. All right, get your cool down in, get your stretches in. I'm gonna get mine in. You guys don't need to watch that. If you guys wanna see a video about stretching, leave it in the comment section because I can make an entire video about stretching. I don't need to add it on this video. This video is long enough already. So you guys wanna see that, let me know. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the workout. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button and uh, have a great workout, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope it helps. Um, that's all I'm here for. I want to help you guys. So, uh, like I said, questions, leave it in the comment section. All right. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for my next video.